Can someone call makeup, please? Makeup! Uh, my name is James. My wife is Marlene. Mother is Marcia. My name is Jed. Uh, my wife's name, name is Jen. And my mom's name is Veronica. I'm Alan Barbin. My wife's name is Elin Barbin. And my mom's name is Tomasa Barbin. My name is Doi. My wife's name is Faye. And my mom's name is Zenaida. Mm. <laughs> yeah, it look good. <laughs> my name's Jay. And uh, my wife's name is Nancy. And my mom's name is Ging. Or Adli. Or whatever. <laughs> All right. Uh, that's better. Hello, it's Michael here. Um, I'm married uh, uh, to Glenda, and my mother is Betty. My name's John, my wife's name is Lee Mackler, and my mother's name is Jojo Mackler. My name is uh, Randy Villagonzalo. My wife's name is Catherine Barrera Villagonzalo, and my mom's name is Miraflor Villagonzalo. My name's Joe Tenereza. I'm gonna talk on behalf of my wife, Dahlia Tenereza, and for my Beautiful mum, Tina Tenereza. My name is Larry Legaspi. Uh, my wife's name is Clarissa. And my mom's name is Helen Legaspi. I'm Freddy. My mom's name is Virgin Sita. And my wife's name is Belinda. My name is Walter. And my wife's name is Lisa. My mother's name is Flor. Um, what made me decide to ask my wife to marry her was... She, re she really loves me. She... Um, uh, the most beautiful woman I've ever met. She had a good personality, she was good to talk to, she was outgoing, she was fun. And, yeah. How she was such a good mother, actually. We were around together for uh, six, seven years and... Um, and time for doing a lot of things and we're ready to uh, settle down and get married. And um, so I asked her the question, yeah. We did stuff. Perfect match for me because I'm not that organized, so. The house was getting built as well. Uh, Aunt Glenn had, had to be married before she um, left the house, so uh, yeah, so we had to get married. It was a confirmation for all of the feelings and the emotions and um, all of those, you know, lovey-dovey stuff. She's very, very, very clean at uh, home and she wanted everything tidy up. Why did I ask her to say? Well, I asked her to, to marry me because I wanted to be with her for the rest of my life. I want to, to just be able to spend just every day with her, you know? Just like, uh, try new things. Sorry, about she always uh, look at me, and and I know that she she really loves me. Beautiful, takes beautiful care of me. Always uh, concerned about my well-being, not asking for a lot in return, even though I do try and spoil her as much as possible. The way she brought up her kids, her kid, kids, kid, one kid at the time. Now we have three. Just try new things with her and just want to, because I love being around her, you know? Yeah. Blessings they are. Three blessings. You really spend more than enough time praying. And you always, and most of the time when you talk, you always talk with, with passion about the Lord. First of all, I want to thank God for giving uh, her to me sensible thing, things and even inspiring words based on the Bible. Taking care of us and she, uh, she's sweet. I just think she's a really good person. I just like um, how she always like cares for everyone, like wants to genuinely... Oh, sorry. Um, what made me decide to ask my wife to marry me? Um, I met her three weeks after I spoke to her on the internet and I flew over to the Philippines. I decided that I think it's time to settle down again. The following year I invited her over to Australia and on September the 15th of that year we decided that we'll get married and start our own life. 
uh, she just uh, genuinely cares for people and that she wants to um, just help them out sort of thing, you know. We were in a sort of relationship for two years and we just had that understanding that we were meant for each other. I saw Kathy studying and I asked her for the key to our uh, apartment. Just like how she's really like focused on um, God and stuff like that. Just, uh, yeah, just, just like that, yeah. But I did eventually ask formally, but yeah, we were already agreed. We have already agreed that we were going to get married, so. Saw her and I didn't realize that she was the landlord's daughter. So, yeah, she's just really fun to be around with. Um, Loved having, uh, spending time with her, just making, me, she makes me laugh a lot with just the silly things that she says. Um, yeah, it's just really silly sometimes, it just doesn't make sense. And yeah. I called her on the phone and uh, I asked her that, uh, would you like to be the mother of my children? <laughs> That's a wonderful feeling, knowing that uh, somebody loved me as much as I love. Her. Catherine Villa Gonzalo and Miraflor Villa Gonzalo, happy Mother's Day and we love you. Happy Mother's Day to all moms. Happy Mother's Day! Say bye bye. Bye bye. Love you. Bye. Oh! Yay. Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day once again. Happy Mother's Day to Faye and to my mom, Sinaida. Happy Mother's Day to all moms in the church and in the world. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day, Marlene, Marcia, and Marcia. Thank you. Happy Mother's Day, Marisa. Yay. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. Yay. Happy Mother's Day, uh, Nancy and Audrey. Happy Mother's Day to everyone, all the mothers, Happy Mother's Day. Woo! Love you all, God bless, Happy Mother's Day. And I wish you all the best. God bless you both. Yay! Let's clap the hands for Mama. Yay! Good girl, baby. <laughs> Love you, Celeste. Love your Mum. Yay! Okay? <laughs> okay, we're finished.